Okay? So give it up for Leslie uh, Reynolds, please. Hey guys. All right, so I'm not playing the guitar, but I have a little piece. I'm gonna share a little bit of myself with everyone. Okay. <laughs> not like that. Okay. Quiet desperation. It's a fabricated dream, stitched together with pieces of your heart. You chose to believe this fallacy because the pain of the inevitable, sorry, let me get this on the podium, because the pain of the in inevitable was too much to bear. You couldn't stand the thought of being alone, and you didn't realize that you were the only one who could mend your broken heart. Quiet desperation. It's something I've been thinking a lot about lately, and it's something that I believe we all have. We see what we want, we can't have it. So we look on, hoping for some sort of distraction, which only ends up teasing us. The distraction dances in the light, just out of reach, because it knows that you are secretly pining for the one thing you may not obtain. We lead lives full of desperation, and instead of facing it, we turn our aggression to our many vices. We find the ones that resemble the people who hurt us when we were young, and we lash out. Instead of killing the pain within ourselves, we fight it more and more. We walk silently, mocking the pain, taunting it with the notion that we don't experience it. We pretend that things that should hurt us feel good and make us stronger. We fake that we are stronger so we will not look weak and we pretend so many things that it's hard to believe that any of us are living at all. I became more myself than I ever thought possible when I realized that all I needed was, well, myself. I found another part of me when I realized that I and I alone could mend my broken heart. I had spent so much time trying to replace the empty hole in my heart when all I had to do was, as cliche as it sounds, turn within myself and look inside. What I found was startling. A picture of my heart as I drew it was scarred, sutured, bleeding, stabbed, and most surprisingly of all, healing. Quiet desperation. It's a fabricated dream stitched together with pieces of your heart. You chose to believe this fallacy because the pain of the inevitable was too much to bear. So let's write it all down and let it burn and start living. For what is life of whisper, secrets, when there is a light waiting to ignite when, within all of us which is pleading to be let out? Let's stop our lives of quiet lies and begin a life of honesty and faith in our hearts.